Gollum, Gollum, where is it? My precious data set. What data? Smeargol has no data at all. Oh yes, we do. Our research data. How long have we been in the Misty Mountains? We know all about the caves and tunnels of the nasty orcs. And now it's gone. But haven't you made a backup of your research data? No, foolish Gollum. They stole it from us. Shut up. With the rule of three, two, one, that would not have happened. Huh. What is the rule of three, two, one? We need three copies of our research data. Three rings to the elven kings under the sky. We save our data on at least two different storage media. For example, in a cloud and on a hard drive. <clears throat> no hard drive. They will cheat you. Sneaky little hobbits. Patience. We bring the storage media to at least one other location. How about the Shire? <clears throat> no, not to the Shire. Not to the tricksy hobbits. They shall not find it. But don't you know about the fair principles for good research data management? <sighs> fair? What do you mean by fair? Is it a riddle? Gollum loves riddles. Smeargol likes riddles too. So, what does fair mean? Fair stands for findable, accessible, interoperable, and reusable. <sighs> An acronym. Fair enough. But what it is, does it mean exactly? Findable means that the data can be found. To that end, we need a juicy description of our data in the metadata and a persistent identifier. Ah, one link to find them. Exactly. And for accessibility, you should clearly define who is allowed to access your data. <clears throat> My data, Gollum, Gollum. No one shall see it. We need it. We must get the data. But you should share your data with others. No. Yes. Ah. Oh. All right. Accessible data is not the same as open data. You can limit the access, for example, to save personal data. Ah, that's good. Our movement profile in the Misty Mountains belongs to us alone. You could declare that no one shall access your data. How about you shall not pass? Excellent. For interoperability, you should use open software and standard data formats. <sighs> He ruins it. He ruins the nice data set. And for reusability, you should document the project very well and use a data license. <sighs> Nasty documentation. No one needs it. Hmm. But what is it good for anyways? so that you yourself know what your data mean next year. Ah, okay, Gollum is forgetful. What was that again about persistent identifier? Ah, 
ah, a persistent identifier is a permanent label for a digital object. This link remains the same, even if the object changes its name or precision. Ah, so this is how it goes, huh? For example, for publications, you may know the digital object identifier. Ah, yes. And for scientists, there is the open researcher and contributor ID, or for short, ORCID. What do you say? ORC ID? Nasty orcs. Kill them. Kill them both. No. ORCID. No goblins involved here. That's very useful. If you have a very common name, or you change your name, or you have two different personalities, what are you talking about? Who are you talking to? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to yourself? No, yes, oh! Look over there. Where? That human in front. Doesn't it look juicy? No, Gollum. We do not eat humans. Humans have a very bad carbon footprint. You can tell that to your dentist. Just one bite. No, not now, my love. Focus on research data management. Best is to write a data management plan first. Ah, nasty bureaucracy. What is it good for? Oh, it's very useful. Actually, it helps us with the planning. And we have to write a data management plan anyways to get the funding. Ah, that's blackmail. Gollum, gollum, wicked. No, it's for our own good. Look, the German Research Association has published a checklist with six points only. Why not seven? Seven to the draw floors in the halls of stone. No, six points are enough. Look, we describe the data, we plan the documentation, we clarify the legal and technical framework, then we regulate the accessibility of our data, and we determine who is responsible for what. Ah, I see. Oh, we could them let do it. Who shall do what? Our friends in the National Research Data Infrastructure and in the German Research Association. Our friends in the University Library and the University Computing Center. Our friends can help us to write the data management plan. Huh. Friends? You don't have any friends. Mm, not listening. No one likes you. I hate you. I hate you. <sighs> Go away. What do you say? <laughs> I should leave. Where would you be without me? Gollum, Gollum, we saved us. It was me. We would never have survived in science without me. Not anymore. <coughs> what was that? The NFDI is looking after us now. What? Leave now and never come back. Ugh. Leave now and never come back. Ugh. Leave now and never come back. We told him to leave and now he's gone. Gone, gone, gone. 
Smear goal is free.